Okay, YouTubers, I am finally finished here with the with the installation. This is the final setup, so you probably haven't seen this one up on the ceiling yet, but I just got it done a couple nights ago. I ran a piece of EMT right across there just to make it look somewhat fancy looking, even though there's still wires coming out, but it really just runs down this wall down here and then makes a connection back there. The heart of it's in this cabinet here. There's the amp that you saw in the previous video clips with it all kind of take up, taken apart and all set up. So this switch. To seek shelter. This is bypass mode. That's the off position and this is relay mode. And yes, I set up a relay to activate this amp whenever I do feature 6.2. Because I don't want this thing running 24-7 like some of those projector seekers you see in the classrooms. I don't like that. I want to be Energy Star Compliance here. Because that kind of matters to me. So I actually care about the environment. But not this set up. The shop is all set up. And I guess I got the strobe going. And I could go to any of these phones. I'll just put it in. So I gotta do feature 6-2. Pretty bright. Severe thunderstorm warning. Pretty bright up in here. Warning has been issued. Please be prepared to seek shelter. Pretty bright. You can see it from the street. I'll leave this turn us off so you can see it through the window when I go to the front yard. Thunderstorm warning. A severe thunderstorm warning has been issued. Please be prepared to seek shelter. And it's running off this power supply that's in here. A severe thunderstorm warning has been issued. Please be prepared to seek shelter. And I'll turn on the amp for the system. Severe thunderstorm. This page will still work. A severe thunderstorm warning has been issued. Please be prepared to seek shelter. Severe thunderstorm warning. It's pretty severe bright. By the way, those with epilepsy, don't. You might not want to watch this part of the video. Severe thunderstorm warning. A severe thunderstorm warning has been issued. These stay in sync too, by the way. This speaker's loud, and this is only at one a watt. Thunderstorm warning. That's a lot of bass. Please be prepared to seek shelter. Yeah, I got this on the suspended ceiling here. It is not integrated with these. These are separate. Severe thunderstorm warning. A severe thunderstorm warning has been issued. So Please be prepared door. to seek shelter. Severe thunderstorm warning. Turn these lights A off. severe thunderstorm warning has been issued. Please be prepared to seek shelter. Severe thunderstorm warning. A severe thunderstorm warning has been issued. Please be prepared to seek shelter. Severe thunderstorm Let's warning. See. A severe thunderstorm warning has been issued. Please be prepared. I don't think you can see that on camera. Huh? Severe thunderstorm warning. A severe thunderstorm warning has been issued. Please be prepared to seek shelter. Severe thunderstorm warning. A severe thunderstorm warning has been issued. Please keep I don't know if you can see it on camera. But they're in sync. Severe thunderstorm Without a sync warning. module, believe a it or not. Severe thunderstorm warning has been issued. Please be prepared to seek shelter. Severe thunderstorm so warning. A hang severe that thunderstorm up. warning has been issued. So Please be prepared to seek shelter. And it's release, it hangs right up. So that's how, this is the final product here. This is how I built it from scratch, basically using modified computer amplifiers and relay logic, some power supplies. Works perfectly, you could even, I could even go in here, same thing. 
Severe. And it reactivates. Severe thunderstorm. So, yep. Even works on here. Except this one. Our morning. Severe thunderstorm warning. A severe. And then it just shuts right off. If you want fire alarms that where the strobes stay in sync without a sync module, my best bet, get an EST Genesis type alarm. That's what I've noticed. So yeah, this is it you guys. This is the final product. This is part three. So might not want to close the door all the way because it'll be dark in here. So stay tuned for more. And I'll try to do another intercom system update video. You might kind of already see a new a new device in the corner there. But I did not do much other than maybe add a couple more. I modified one of the speakers and added one on. Uh, everything else is the same, but I'll still show you guys anyways. So be sure to subscribe to my channel and stay tuned.